Hey guys and welcome back to a brand new video and in this video we're going to be starting a new series of guides. Um, so this series is going to be all about the NPCs. Uh, I was hoping to do this quite a time ago when I finished the 100% walkthrough but uh, I don't really have time. I don't think it's too late to start it. I'm pretty sure that most of you there's some little thing that you didn't know about a lot of the NPCs. Uh, so yeah guys so hopefully this will be helpful. I have had a few comments recently as well um, recommending me to do this this series so yeah um so today we're going to be starting off with probably one of the most interesting um storyline quest npcs uh and interesting i mean tragic uh a lot of people probably think this one's shorter than it really is uh and of course we're talking about viola's family which is um the wife of gascoigne and the mother of this little girl we talked to um once we come out of the sewers uh, in this window here i'm pretty sure everybody knows how to um find this window uh, the first time we talked to her, it's going to give us the music box, and in case anybody, didn't, somebody didn't know, uh, the music box stuns Gascoigne when he hears it, so if you're having trouble with the boss battle, you can stun him. Uh, but anyway, the next thing we're going to do is go ahead and kill Gascoigne, so that's her father dead. And then we're going to jump down here and also discover that her mother has been killed by her father, which is Gascoigne, because he goes crazy. Uh, obviously, you'll pick up the brooch from her body. Uh, the reasonable thing and the most common thing uh, anybody would do is just take it straight back to her and the quest would be pretty much over. She'd just be sad and kill herself a lot earlier. Um, but to complete this quest 100% properly, we're going to continue on to Cathedral Ward and talk to the NPC just so our character knows um, that this is a safe haven and that we can send people here. Um, the second thing we're going to do before going to talk to the little girl again is destroy the brooch. I know it kind of sounds sad or whatever, uh, but without doing these two things that we're not going to be able to continue the quest. So once we've done those two things, um, we're going to reset the map, tell her that we haven't found her her mother, and also we're going to tell her about the, the chapel and that it's a safe haven. So uh, obviously that she says thanks, she says that she loves us just as much as her mum, dad and granddad, whatever. And uh, so then we're going to reset the map once more um, and come to the, the big pig um, guy in the sewers. Uh, we're going to kill him just like we always do. Uh, but this time, instead of just giving his blood bows, he is going to give us a red messenger ribbon. So that means that the little girl was on her way to the safe haven and pretty much died to that big pig. So yeah, so once that's happened, we're going to continue through the game until we beat Rom, which is the spider boss, I'm pretty sure everybody knows that by now. Uh, once we've done that, we're going to come back to her original window, and we're going to discover that she has an older sister. So um, her older sister's worried about where her little sister's gone, and she asks us if we know anything. So this is where we're going to give her the uh, the red ribbon we just or we picked up previously from the pig, and then she finds out she's, she's pretty much dead. So, um, this is where the tragic part comes in. We're going to reload the map. Uh, we're going to find out now that there's no response. The light's off. And we're going to come down this ladder. And, yep. Uh, she has just um, pretty much took her own life uh, since she has nobody left and she is all alone in this world. Um, her father, you killed. Her mother, her father killed. And I guess we could kind of say that we kind of killed our little sister accidentally as well. <laughs> So yeah, so now we just pick up the white messenger ribbon, which is pretty much the um, red one, but she obviously cleaned it or something without the blood. And that is the end of quite a tragic story. <laughs> so yeah, guys, uh, let me know in the comments which NPC you'd like me to talk about next. Uh, I will be telling you all the quests you can do for each NPC. So yeah, guys, if this is helpful or you discovered something new, please go like and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Happen again, and you 